Hello everybody, it's Nick here, and like usual, I say this almost all the time, it has been a while, hasn't it? Um, I just wanted to announce that my new single, um, called Leader in Love, has dropped. Um, well, not just yet. I uploaded it, it's waiting to get approved. But keep an eye on this video, because in the description, I will be putting links to wherever you can get it, and I'll be updating it. Spotify is usually the first to get it, and I think I told people this, but um, I no longer, uh, I think like my, with the exception of my first song or two, I don't allow any of my music to be uploaded to YouTube, um, except my covers. My covers are free. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the one I did for Think For Yourself, and Margaritaville was kind of a scary one, because I wrote that because, or I did that cover because I was going on, I was going to Vegas, right? for my vacation in June and Margaritaville's down there and that's like my favorite place to eat down there and uh and then all of a sudden you know Jimmy Buffett passes away a couple months later I was not expecting that and I find it kind of eerie now <laughs> but um I just wanted to I wanted to address that and then um yeah so the reason the reason why I don't allow my stuff on YouTube is a few different things, and I I don't really want to go into detail. Um, I just don't agree with some of their practices. For one, um, two, I just think you know you can listen to the songs for free. And there's other, probably other streaming services that I have my song uploaded to that where you can do that. Um, I hope not. Um, I haven't really made any. I haven't got any pay since I started doing music. Um, but I'm doing it because I love it, you know, and, I'm sh and it's an easy way to share it with my family and friends. Um, my dad actually is like, oh, I'll buy your song on iTunes or whatever. It's like, or he doesn't have iTunes, but like, he's like, oh, I'll buy your song. I'm like, you're my dad. You can have it for free. He's like, no, no, no. You, I need to support you. And it's like, all right, you know, cool to have a father like that and not one that goes, uh, you know, being a musician is nice, but how about being a doctor or a lawyer instead? Like that's supposed to be more realistic you know, me getting into neurosurgery, but then, you know, I'm an uh, electrician now. I didn't think I'd be doing that. Not in a million years. If you told me that before, I'd have you committed to an insane asylum. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so the cover covers are one thing. I don't want to make money off of those. So I just upload those for free for anyone to enjoy. Um, and I'm glad people enjoy those. Um, I usually, I the think for yourself one. I knock that out in a few hours. Uh, there's one I'm working on right now, but it's uh, um, uh, it's gonna take more than a few hours. Uh, so, uh, and again, I've just been really busy. You know, at work, it's just um, I actually don't do a whole lot right now. Next year, it's gonna work's gonna pick up considerably, but um, I just end up like being really tired and stuff when I get home. I go to sleep, and then I wake up, and then I go back to work. You know, and it's it's a rinse repeat thing. It's uh. But I do like my new job, in case anyone's wondering. Um, but also, um, another reason I haven't been too active online is because I have a personal family issue. Um, and I don't I don't like to bring too much of my personal life into stuff. In fact, you know, I'm, I don't know about before, but, you know, now I'm pretty secretive about my, my personal life. Um, then again, there's not a whole lot to tell anyway. So, there's that. Um... Jeez, what else? What else do I want to talk about? Because I don't want to end this on a sour note. Um, well, I did get a new game. Actually, I actually think I got a couple here. Um, I bought the... See, I always get a notification every time I'm recording something. I always... Oh, here we go. Speaking of which, my new single is live on... Please tell me Spotify. Please tell me Spotify. Yes! My song's on Spotify. I will post that link in the description. <laughs> Alright, now I'm, I'm very excited. Um, this song, the song I did, Leader in Love, um, I had to go through like a two-month training process at my new job. And one day we had some downtime, and I was actually surprised, because I brought my notebook in, in case I wanted to write lyrics. And I'm not a very good lyricist, but I actually ended up completing like three song lyrics that day. And this is one of them. It's actually... Um, it's actually kind of based off the Cattanooga Cat song, Baby Come Back, or Come Back Baby, Come Back, whatever. Um, you can find that easily on YouTube. 
And I'll, I'll admit that, you know, because it was kind of rushed, the riff, the intro riff is kind of taken from that, but, I, you know, I tried to make it original. I don't know how good of a job I did. Because um, I like to do a lot of pastiches and of, some, of song styles, or of artists that I like. But I also want to stick, like, you know, my song Adventure. I like to uh, kind of stick it uh, or, like, make it my own thing. I'm not trying to... In that song, I'm not trying to copy anyone else's style. That is directly from me. That's that's the Nick style right there, okay? You got that. Um, <laughs> by the way, um, that's why I'm wearing um, headphones. I was actually just recording parts for my cover. And, uh, yeah, and now I'm actually hearing myself talk, so I'll know if I'm too loud. But I'm not too loud. No, not really. <laughs> Um, but anyways, yeah, let me show you what, what I picked up. It's nothing exciting, but I got a couple disc system games. Um, first one I got here, and now I'm proud to say I own all the HAL versions of this game, <laughs> um, is Othello. I suck at this game, and I still don't get how to play it. Um, but it actually does have another game on it. It's got, a uh, Pro Wrestling on it. Because, um, mm, mm. Oh, got like a hair in my mouth. Can't get it out. Yuck. Uh, anyone want a sample? <laughs> uh, anyway, so <laughs> as you can see, um, the B side of this disc doesn't have anything on it. So someone put pro wrestling on it. I've never played pro pro wrestling, but um, I heard it's okay for a early title. Um, and then the other game I got, and this does have the manual. I it's over here. I'm too lazy to get it. Volleyball. These are these are both cheap games at the local game shop, so that's why I picked them up. Um, and then I got one game that I that I wanted, and that I actually did a video on this. I'll probably upload that later. But that is a Super Mahjong for the Super Famicom. So I uh, this game was hard to find, and it's not because it's rare or anything, but it's because the title is so generic. If you type in Super Mahjong Super Famicom, you'll get pretty much every other Mahjong game on the Super Famicom besides this one. Most of the time, Super Mahjong Taikai, which I also have, the one by Koei, um, is the one you get. Um, Mahjong, I suck at this game. I'm, I'm horrible. I'm the worst Mahjong player in the world. But it's like Jin Rummy. If you ever played Jin Rummy, um, I always compared it to poker only because, you know, it's popularity. I mean, Jin Rummy's not too popular in the U.S., but, you know... Texas Hold'em Poker, you know, it's kind of like the equivalent, but it plays more like Jin Rummy, and, you know, it's basically you get 14 tiles, try to make, you know, straights and three three of a kinds and stuff, so and pairs and all that, so that's the simplified way of playing it. Or as we know it in the States, uh, Ritchie Mahjong. So, fun fact. I did a video of that game, though, kind of showing you how to play a Mahjong. Uh, might upload that later. Excuse me. Um, but we'll see. I don't know. Um, I also want to apologize to uh, going back to my song. I'm sorry that took so long to release again. Uh, it was supposed to be released on like 1st of November, and here we are like 12, 14 days later. And <laughs> it's like, uh, I like I said, just being busy from work, and then you know, my, my family issue I have going on, you know, it hasn't left me much time to do what I want. But you know, family comes first, you know, and I hope everyone takes that to heart too family comes first but um that's all i've been up to though i've been up to a whole lot because i'm too busy being at work or sleeping or you know um saturday for example you know i went to have breakfast with the old man and then i i got back home and i just snoozed the day away you know which i tried not to do but i was so so tired and it's like i couldn't i couldn't help myself i just got home and i crashed so um there is one thing. There's one thing I wanted to up. In fact, this is kind of besides the song. This is why I wanted to do the video. I want to get back into making game reviews again, and for the obscure slash unknown games, like you know these shogi games or these mahjong games, like I'm getting for example. And uh, I never found any good video software, but I think I'm gonna break down and get Adobe Premiere because it looks like on the site you can buy it for under 20 bucks a month and that's something which within my budget i don't agree with the subscription based software thing i think it's really stupid but i've really been wanting to make videos and um 
I do have a very old copy of Adobe Premiere which worked on my XP machine, but it does not work on Windows 10, unfortunately. I don't even think it worked on 7. Maybe it did. But um, I do, I, they have a Black Friday deal. I might, I might break down and get it. Like about 20 bucks a month. That's, like I said, it's within my budget. And um, it sounds like I might be picking up overtime in the new year anyway. So uh, I am saving up for a Christmas vacation because my work is cool enough to give me a 10-day vacation for Christmas. That's really cool. It's actually 11 days because New Year's Day I'm off to, um, which I didn't know I would have um, stayed an extra day. And I think everyone already knows where I'm going. I'm going to Las Vegas. <laughs> um, because it's the last time I'm going to get to go to the Mirage before it becomes the... I'm pretty sure it's going to be crappy Hard Rock Hotel. I will eat my words and I will apologize if I'm wrong. Okay, how about that? But also next year, I'm not going to go back to Vegas. I'm actually going to go to Japan. So um, I need to save up for that. I also need to save up for a work-related matter. But um, it's nothing bad or anything. Um, but again, I like I don't like to go too much into detail. But I do want to start doing game reviews again. And I really want to start, you know, because that's what this channel is built on. And, you know, I like showing my showcasing my music and stuff but the problem is um you know like, like i said i know some people aren't here for the music they're here for the games and you know i i don't want to really do the unscripted stuff anymore the funny thing is i have a bunch of scripts that i write it's easy for me to write scripts but i didn't have any video editing software so i had no way to like even if i want to just record game footage for like 10 minutes and then have me talking over for 10 minutes you know i couldn't do that um so um, this is, uh, I, I might, I might cave and get Premiere, um, like I said, 20, that's, that's about, you know, good for me. I don't agree with it, but, you know, until I find something better at least, and I, in a way, I think it's a good thing if I pay monthly for it, because that'll motivate me to, to make reviews. So I'll probably do like one a month or something. I'd like to do that. But again, it's gonna, it's gonna be slow for a while because like I said, my job and everything, it's just... You know, I'm tired when I come home and, you know, um, my band actually doesn't have any rehearsals for the rest of the year. We have like a gig next weekend, um, or I should say this weekend. <laughs> um, so there's that, but, uh, so that, you know, I'm not going to be doing anything today. Um, and just a little, uh, I don't normally throw shouts there, but I wanted to thank, uh, R&D Stranger for completing the R the Family Daily series. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. But uh, it's basically where every single day he would review every Famicom game ever released. Um, I think there's like maybe one or two exceptions to that, but for the most part, he reviewed every single commercially released Famicom game, and that's really cool for someone like me, you know. Like there's certain obscure games I wanted to see reviewed, like Famicom Shogi Ryo Osen and Famicom Ego Nyomon, and he actually covered both of those. So that's pretty cool. Um, again, I that that's what I'm here for. I'm not just here for any games or whatever. You know, I'm here for the obscure, unknown stuff. And hopefully, by me playing those games or showing them, you know, people will be you know tempted to try them. Now, of course, not every game I review is going to be a winner. I'm going to review a few crappy games as well. One thing I really want to do to do is go back and play Hills Far and rip that game a new asshole. Um, especially because I know a lot more about it. And now I actually know who worked on the damn game. So uh, that's pretty cool. Um, I need to start slapping myself again every time I say um or I stutter. That's something I got to do, man. Um, but uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I will have a package coming from Japan probably like next week, so you can look forward to a video of that. Um, I'm enjoying my new Nord keyboard that I got. I mean, I just love this thing, and it's it's really cool. Um, does pretty much everything I've ever wanted a keyboard to do for me. So, and I, you know, with all the knobs on it, I didn't think I'd get used to it. And I, I did a video like demoing it, but I never released it. Excuse me, but maybe I should. Who knows? But this video has gone on for too long now. I need to go. So, um, in fact, it's 5.35. I actually should be asleep for work. Um, but I went to sleep when I got home. Woke up like a little later and here I am. So, I'll see you guys later. God bless. Peace out.
Have a great day. You better have one. I'm watching you. All right. See y'all later.